Jacob Rees-Mogg. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Further to the question from the Right Honourable Gentleman for Leeds Central, did my Right Honourable Friend hear the report on the Today programme this morning that other European leaders were making it clear that they would not accept a deal on any terms? And does he share my view that what is sauce for the goose is sauce for the gander? Yeah. Uh, may, may, I, may I congratulate my uh, Honourable Friend on his, oh, I believe it's his, his sixth child. Uh, many congratulations uh, on, on that. Uh, and uh, he, he makes a, a very good point about the negotiating stance of our friends and partners across the channel. They do sound at the moment as though they're, they're pretty hard over, as we say in the, in the Foreign Office, but I have no doubt that in the fullness of time a suppleness will descend and a willingness to compromise, because after all, a great Brexit deal, a great free trade deal, a deep and special partnership is in the interests of both, of, both sides of the channel. Mr. Speaker, uh, given the Prime Minister